Let's talk about the Atari Jaguar CD. Now, I've done the reviews as the nerd of the Atari Jaguars and uh, part one and part two. Uh, and just a little recap, uh, the Atari Jaguar CD is a very faulty console and it just doesn't work. And, um, and I made that very clear in the video. And since then, somebody sent me a working Jaguar CD. So I have played it, um, but I've been holding off on it because I haven't really found a game that was really that bad. We have a stack of games here. We're just gonna try some different ones out and see what they're like. I've actually never played uh, Jaguar CD before. I've played regular Jaguar uh, quite a few times. Actually, uh, I really like uh, Doom on Jaguar, um, even though it doesn't have music, but uh, and there's some other games I like, but Jaguar CD, nope, never played it, and I assume that's because uh, they're faulty. It, well, you're gonna have the rare opportunity to play it right now. Here we go. Battle Morph. Now, this is the sequel, I believe, to Cyber Morph. You know, where did you learn to fly? Oh, uh, right. Where did it looks you like learn it. to fly? Where did you learn oh. to fly? Good. No. Oh, God. It's the cousin of fucking Where Did You Learn to Fly? Good luck. It's the cousin of Where Did You Learn to Fly? I gotta get used to the controls. I've never even played this console before. It's Christmas trees. Uh -huh. They look like Lego Christmas trees. <laughs> How do you like that when a big wall just appears right in front of you? You move through space so quickly, it's hard to even shoot anything because by the time you hit the button, you're already like past it. There's not a lot of uh, depth perception, yeah. like not a lot of advanced knowing of what's gonna appear in front of you. This is truly like when they were trying to figure out how to make these kind of games. I feel like I'm going around in a circle. I remember here. Star Fox being a lot better than this, though. Yeah. Oh my God, Star Fox was awesome compared to this. All right. So if I crash into something, will, will the blue face come up? I wondered. Let's see if it happens. Oh, see, it didn't even come up. Maybe they um, they they learned from the first game that it was really annoying to keep having that face popping up. Where did you learn to fly? Where did you learn to fly? I do have to say it was pretty disappointing when I uh, finally got a working Jaguar CD. I mean, it was great. It was nice to know that I could finally play it, so I had closure on that whole thing. But okay, now Mike's had enough, so now I'm playing. <laughs> I, di I died, my shit blew up. Okay. Because I spent so much time on those videos where I was hyping it up as if, you know, I'm trying to get the Jaguar CD to work, and and finally I do get it to work in, in, now in real life, and it's like, it's they're not just. Good. It's not even that, it's just that I'm struggling to think of anything to say about it. No, I, I really don't think that this game is good because. At the same time, they, there was Star Fox. Star Fox was a great game. You actually knew what you were doing. You would get to the end, there'd be a boss. In this, it's just like you fly around randomly, and it's like hard to figure out what to do. The controls are pretty bad. You just slam into the mountains. There's bad, and then there's funny bad, and, and this is not really funny. <laughs> like, I don't know. I mean, I'm not... <laughs> Yeah, it's not really funny. It's just not good. It's just not good. That's <laughs> that's the best way to say it. Blue Lightning. All right, so we definitely got a fighter jet type of game here. Europe, South Africa, Europe, South America, North America. America, fuck yeah! <laughs> this is your last plane, be careful out there. Well, like, you, <laughs> this character that you're playing as has been in a lot of shit before. He's like Launchpad <laughs> McQuack. They, they, they don't want to give him another fucking plane because they know he's going to crash it. <laughs> I keep making the comparison, but really, like, this does look a lot like Top Gun. You know, it reminds me of uh, Afterburner. I'm dead oh, already. No game. Oh, my God. All right, select. Oh, boy. It takes so long to get to the fucking actual game. You got you to gotta select your player, select your weapons, um, put your access card Name into the, the fucking player. mission, um, accept the mission, then you gotta wait for the animation of the plane taking off, then finally when you get to the game, you die in two seconds, and then you gotta go through it all, all over again. <laughs> That's awful. One hit? Is, was that it? You got I, hit once? I think it was one hit. Like, oh look, you can, 
You can blow up the trees. Look at look look look. You can, when you blow up the tree, they actually explode. <laughs> Why would you ever be doing that? Why would a tree explode? It should just like fall over. It's the opposite of of a game that's like good for the environment. You know, you know what I'm trying to say? It's, it's just like you're just taking down trees. <laughs> Those trees are assholes. Okay, now we're gonna try out Hover Strike. Okay. You know, I think I own most of the, the games that are on this console because there wasn't really? that many. It's no. kind of similar to the Virtual Boy or the 32X yeah. consoles that just f flopped. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I don't even remember if I said this in my my nerd episodes, but did I mention the thing about how um, lots of Atari Jaguars were used for uh, dental equipment? Like, I think no. it's like a it's like a thing that like. You know, one of the machines that like x-rays your teeth yeah, or something yeah. like that, you know? Um, they used the, the shell of Atari Jaguars and painted them white. And so, so I, I'm not even kidding. Like basically what I'm saying is an Atari Jaguar could take a picture of your teeth. If I go to a dentist and the, and the dude and pulls out the Atari Jaguar, I'm out of there. I'm yeah. sorry. Something's always up with Atari. Like either they they bury all the games in a desert or something, or the or they recycle the plastic for dental equipment or something. There's always like just strange stuff going on yeah. with Atari. Like all tre the time. Treasure hunts and like yeah, the sword weird quest. Shit. Anyway, so this looks like you're in a tank. Look at this. You want to get dizzy? And you're okay. Oh, 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 oh. So you're in a tank on the Death Star shooting oranges. So it's kind of like the game Battle Morph because you don't know what to do. You just you just ride around and like I, I give up. Like try to do something. All right. Like you, you, fi find something to shoot at or <laughs> it's like that's the that's, that's the recurring problem in all these games. You know, don't you love it how when you go into something like this? Yeah. Well, you're going. Yeah. You would think it would be a little more smooth. You would kind of go over over it, you know. It's it's just one of those games that, that it, it's like you can't even look at it. <laughs> you can't look at it. You can't. <laughs> like it's just look at the, look what's going on here. Look at all this. It's so disorienting. Oh, you think it's disorienting? This <laughs> <laughs> is a terrible fucking game. Oh my god. All right, uh, Hover Strike uh, sucks ass. Yeah, there's some great classic old games, but this is not fucking one of them. This is garbage. This is shit from a shit fountain. It, it, it's like you're 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 riding through garbage too. It's it, it just looks like like it's not even appealing to look at. It's just, like, it's just gray and like dots all around the floor. It's like, look, at it. it's, look at all the dots. It's just. <laughs> this game. All right, this is Highlander, based on the animated series. Well, I don't know what to do, so maybe you should start first. Uh, how about you start? You want me to start? Okay. <laughs> wait a second. So I'm hitting. So I want to go down. So I'm hitting. Wait, 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 wait. You better watch I'm, out. I'm hitting down. I'm hitting down, and he's going. He's, he's going not, back. He's not gonna let you figure it out. Go right. Go right. Go right. Go right. And he's going left. I'm hitting right, and look at this. I'm hitting right, and he's going left. You're dead. And who's this way. guy whipping me? Oh, he killed you. He killed your ass. And that's it. Game over. You're dead. No, let's wait through a whole animated screen now. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. All right, you have to try this. Oh, did you see that? He really? jumped and fucking whale yeah, through the fucking I know. head. Look at this. Like, I can't even. I, I'm. I'm hoping he'll just run into me. It's not <laughs> happening. <laughs> Oh, finally! Oh, I go. finally got him. It, it's these these views are just like the way it keeps changing. <laughs> like that that just like I can understand once he reaches the end of the screen, it should mm -hmm. change. Like right about there, that made sense. Yeah. But when it happens, when you're just like you're in the middle of the screen, and you're just bit, like right there. Like yeah. why? There's no reason it needed to change right there. You know what this kind of reminds me of a little bit is that um, one of those early uh, survival horror games. Uh, what, what was that game called? Oh, you found a bu you found a, a rolling, rolling rock. In the dark. It's a rolling rock. <laughs> I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna use that. I guess. Are you gonna there drink you go. it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Check, check that out. Oh, that's what you need on top of all that is to be drunk. 
Oh my god. So you have an even harder oh, time like, walking around? Like Conker's Bad Fur Day. The game starts off and you're so disoriented and like you can't even like control yourself. Oh, look how his feet are like in the ground. Uh, look, I can't. What's blocking me? I'm too far away to even see what the hell I'm doing. Oh, oh god, no, here comes the guy to beat guys. you over the head. <laughs> you know that there's 17 buttons on this thing? That's a lot of buttons. <laughs> you know how many the original Atari had? One. One. And the games were better. <laughs> yeah, they were. Frogs and flies. Yeah. Fast food. Kaboom. Kaboom. Stampede. Space, space invaders. Of course, the camera has to change 18 different angles before you can go yeah, through this fucking it's just, it's Oh, ridiculous. watch out. Here comes one of those guys. I know. I, know. I don't even know. Oh, oh there's shit. two of them. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh, oh they God. Are they hitting each other? I think they're beating each other oh, up. Oh, are they? Oh, oh it's bitch. terrible. Take it in the face, you motherfucker. Oh, no. Okay, okay. I'm going to run. I'm going to run. Just run. Just run. I'm trying. I'm trying. I can't even get out. Just go along that path. Oh, can this, can this guy fucking pick up the pace? He's in no hurry. It's oh like he my... wants to have the ship beat. Oh out my of god! In that little angle change. Oh, there you go. Right? Now you're running. What are you doing? Oh, now? I don't know. I think I think if you hold uh, hold up for a little while, it eventually picks up speed. I guess. I love how the the there's no music or anything. It's just like peaceful. You just hear like birds and stuff. And it's like a guy chasing somebody who, who's gonna, <laughs> gonna get the ship like beat, beat him. him senseless. <laughs> oh god! Oh god! Here comes here comes the guy. Oh no! Time to get beat. What is going? How do you run? I don't even know how I did it before. Run! Run! <laughs> I did it before. He runs when he feels like it. It is. That's oh, true. now he's running. He's running. Oh my god. He's running. Maybe it's like certain <laughs> screens you can run and other ones you can't. Well, he's running right now. And but... I never know what to do. Every time it, it keeps changing the angle. All right, I'm just gonna fight him. I yeah. guess. Look at, the, look at this fight. Isn't this great? And there's also like a tree. like a. There's a tree in the way, and we're like, look at this. All I see is pixels flickering around. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, and when, oh, my God. You didn't even know that guy was there, and then the camera cut. and I'm, then... I'm stuck. Oh, my God. I'm, <laughs> They're I'm... just beating the Oh, my God. I can't even get out of this. They're beating the shit out of you. <laughs> I can't get out of this. Look at them. You're getting the shit beat out of you. This is ridiculous. <laughs> go to the go to the. I'm, uh, I'm just going like, for the water. I'm yeah, going go for, for it. Oh god, oh, oh god. god. Oh god. Oh, boom, oh my god. <laughs> here. Here. Oh god. Time to get beat, boy. <laughs> get away from Time to it. get beat, boy. Wait, you're doing good. You're doing good. Keep getting away. Oh my These god. These guys are fucking mean. What did this guy what did this poor orange haired kid do to these, do to these fucking green warrior men? You orange haired freak! We're gonna beat your fucking ass senseless, you little freckled fuck. What, what do they want with them? I think they hate him because he has orange hair. They just hair. don't like it. They don't like the way he walks. He just he walks fuck. I don't like the way he walks either. <laughs> You know, let's let's all kill him. Come here, Pippi Long Stackins. Boom! <laughs> Take it up Pippi, your nose. It's like a one uh, pigtailed Pippi Long <laughs> with missing feet. The feet just like disappear into the ground. <laughs> that was Highlander. That Hi was... Highlander is one of the worst games I've ever played. Period. It is. So there you go. Now I can understand why you took a shit on it.